What's good, Homo Squad? It's your boy, Homo Ziggy. We back here with another reaction, and hey, we on to the UK now and such, and we got Central C CC Freestyle now. Hey, it's been a. Have I? I don't think I've ever had a Central C on my channel before, and look, I want to dive in more deep into other music reactions and such especially mainstream wise and such on the artists that i think to me personally right to me that i feel like they're fire but they don't get talked a lot as much or they fire but nine times out of ten they involve in some shit so hey with central she central she central c i don't think i've ever put him on the channel have i no i don't think i have but either way, we gonna check this out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my socials up there. And without further ado, let's get in the video. Oh. Let me get a tea, please. Yeah, to my UK them, grudging them. Yo, you don't wanna see man jump out the skip to the whip skip, make your heart. You got lyrics down here, so hold on. You already know what I gotta do. Gotta put y'all on the theater mode screen and such, so hold up. Let's get it. Yo! You don't wanna see man jump out the skip Hit the whip skip, make your heart beat skip Many time that your song comes on, we skip And with the Marlies, not Bob or Skip We got the Charlie and the chocolate chip Setting up shop like a Costco trip Surrender your flag cause you're not no quick Don't be angry at me that you got no hits You can go ends and they all no sense You can go ends and they might know you Try to leave London and cross the bridge And ask who he is and they got no clue I'm a million mm. hm. Cross the London You might cross the London and the bridge London bridge and such Okay, hold on, hold on and hey, you already know with you whenever it comes to UK rap and such, hey, y'all be thinking one thing for sure with the UK, their type of beefs or so or whatever, their type of music stuff, it could be it could relate it to rap, to the it could be lyrical, it could be about the streets and anything in between. One thing's for sure, they know how to make a bop. Even if they're in a beef. Not Bob or Skip, we got the Charlie Somebody. and the chocolate chip. Setting up shop like a Costco trip. Surrender your flag cause you're not no quick. Don't be angry at me that you got no bits. You can go ends and they all no sense. You can go ends and they might know you. Try to leave London and cross the bridge and ask who he is and they got no clue. I'm a millionaire, bro. What about you? Fuck the drill, that's not what I do. <laughs> I trapped and they changed my life. You trapped and all you thought was losing my daughter. You trapped and. And hey, nine times out of ten, really think about it. Central C. The moment I know about him from that Dojo one, you can guarantee he's the type of UK artist where even if he's not talking about drill, he make it sound like he drills, but he really doesn't and he can make a viral fire hit. With This is where you can know, this is where with artists, especially with UK artists, they know how to combine them hard gangster type lyricism but with some bars in it too, like bro. And trust me, with the UK artists, boy, do they know a lot slang girls. They know a lot more slang. They got a lot more slang than most US artists does. Straight up. And then I cross the bridge and ask who he is and they got no clue. I'm a millionaire, bro. What about you? Fuck the drill, that's not what I do. <laughs> I trapped and they changed my life. You trapped and all you thought was losing my door or deal, get killed by a weapon and die of old age. Would it still say that I died as a legend? I'm taking a loss, I don't mind, it's a lesson. I'm the guy that's applying the pressure, that's why it's green lights on a diamond tester. DM your bitch, I bet you reply, they put me in a lay, they book you in Leicester. <laughs> this day makes shit. I've been the kid since A Rexes. It was COVID mask and latexes. Now splatting them A Mexes. Shit, shit. I seen a snippet. Mm. I really see it slaps on you. The trailer shit. I mean, it slaps on me, bro. If that ain't such a crazy thing, where people, when people hear about how when certain music or whatever and such, even if they know it's when they know it's trash, not that even if when they know it's trash, they're gonna say that shit sounds so fire on you. <laughs> Meaning that nigga, you know how the only way can make it more better. Just don't hear it at all. Just put that bitch on mute and... Because crazy enough, you would think something sounds so fire just when you mute it, right? You would think like, oh, they're going crazy and such. 
but put on the sound and boy oh boy does it sound shit whether it's a music whether it's a trailer don't matter it will sound shit <laughs> Price three lights on a diamond tester. DM your bitch, I bet she reply. They put me in a lay, they book you in Leicester. Leicester. This day makes shit. I've been the kid since A Rexes. It was COVID mask and latexes. Now splatting them Amexes. Shit, shit. I seen a snippet. I release it. Slap some mute the trailer. Shit. I'm in Las Vegas watching the Super Bowl. Thinking about moving to Taylor Swift. I don't need to go to the bank for a loan. Accountant said my accounts look great. I can spend every day and the cash won't go. Being OT so long that my accent changed. Sattening girl, you're right. Corporate voice when I ask. So crazy, nigga. Cause that accent, the accent change, boy or oh boy has, bro. Some of my, y'all gotta remember. I'm Jamaican. Well, for those who don't know, right? For those who don't know, who has, who is my first, who's watching me for the first time, I'm Jamaican. So even with my act, so even though y'all hear me speaking like this and such, people, do you know how much times in my family they be saying about you because? I adapted to the US styles in a way that me change. You see how quick me switchy? Yeah. You can't take me out of Jamaica, but you can't take the Jamaican out of me. You mad? Just because me adapted to them style and such. Not everything I adapted to and such, but me, fit, me find a way how for fitting and so. You sit and slap some mute the trailer shit I'm in Las Vegas watching the Super Bowl Thinking about moving to Taylor Swift I don't need to go to the bank for a loan Accountant said my accounts look great I can spend Great. every day and the cash won't go Being OT so long that my accent changed Sattening girl you're right Corporate voice when I answer the phone Left wrist swollen mm. covered in ice You would have thought that I fractured a bone A grin mm. on You would thought I fractured a bone Ooh, You see what I mean They can talk that flick the way how they can do it, they can talk that flick shit and come in with a bar with it. Won't go. Being OT so long that my accent changed. Something girl, you're right. Corporate voice when I answer the phone. Left wrist swollen, covered in ice. You would have thought that I fractured the phone. Fractured phone. Income housing. Now my rent is eighteen thousand. The UK's most famous writers probably leave me off the JK Rowling. Make ten M of my day. Shout out to the Harry Potter's nigga. What you mean? The UK's most famous writers probably leave me off the JK Rowling Make 10 of my debut album Label don't even care how it's sounding Tell them that we don't need a and I'll do it myself I make it without 123 I was paying my homage Now I need them to give me my flowers While I'm alive bro give me my props A lot of man watched like I see their sour We celebrate wins like sentences bro fresh out the bit We celebrate wins like sentences And bro that part right there where Hold on what he said Debut album, label don't even care how it's sounding. Tell them that we don't need A and R's, I'll do it myself. I'm paying my homage. Now I need them to give me my flowers. When I'm alive, bro, give me my props. When I'm alive, bro, give me my props. Cause really think about it. And I know it might sound corny and such, but most people don't be giving a lot of artists their props after they pass away. Cause for when they are alive right now and such, even if they were fire. Most people are like, eh, he's alright and all. But as soon as one day, and I don't wish, and God forbids, when they pass away and such, right? You see how quick all the bandwagoners want to hop on it and such, saying, oh, he was a fire, this and Nah, this is how I feel. If you didn't know about them, or if you barely know about them, keep that same energy when they were alive. And if they pass, and when they pass away, cause right then and there you look fake as hell. Cause that, that's why you'll always see with me that when it comes to a music artist, no matter who it is, whether they was alive or when they pass away, however I feel about them, however I was about them, if I didn't know much about them, I didn't know much about them. If I knew a lot about them, then I'll know a lot about them. But if I'm indifferent, I'm indifferent. I don't, you, trust me. A lot of artists that you see that I might react to or might listen to and such, if I know they're that fire and such, to me, I don't care about anybody else, but to me, if I know they're fire, I will know if they're fire and I will stick on to them. Trust me. You, trust me. From the moment, from the moment when I li popped up on the U.S., from when I moved to the U.S., most Florida to from 2014 to 2019 
and a little bit of 2022-ish and such. Nigga, I was mostly bumping Migos. I was bumping mostly Migos, Eminem, who was, uh, uh, Lil Uzi, Kendrick a little bit, J. Cole for shit sure, who was, uh, but then throughout the year and such, throughout the next four years and such, from 2020 to now, it's mostly been the, my nerdcore stuff. Rest of but either way, from them parts, trust me, you heard the five I said, five or six and said, I was, mm, I would know from my, from my personal opinion, and then my, and plus with my Jamaican music, you don't want me to start on that one, but yeah, I always show my props to the artists who I listen to the most for today, from their stuff in the past, and now. Label don't even care how it sounded. Tell them that we don't need A and R's. I'll do it myself. I make it without. One twenty three. I was paying my homage. Now I need them to give me my flowers. Why not my dad? Give me my props. A lot of man washed like I see their sour. We celebrate wins at sentences. Bro, fresh out the bin, get a champagne shower. We're not on the block, no more. In mansions, tell them bro, lay off the gang thing. Now it's mad. I grew where the pagans live. It's a love hate relationship. I was gone, went away for a bit, and now I'm back. Like wait a minute, I'm back. UK rap ain't dead. I mean, some guys are, but I don't relate. Like, UK rap ain't dead. I mean, some guys are, but I can't. Because, hey, a lot of the times, them UK artists, whenever they in that beef mode, or not even just UK, just anybody who who still be on that draw type mode and such, I can't even whistle that loud and such, but just know, a lot of y'all, it, it, it's like this. Y'all have the chance to get out of the hood, right, with this music shit. Like, a lot of gangster rappers don't be... A lot of rappers, when they were in the streets before, and they have a way out of that shit with this music stuff, y'all gotta realize, if y'all really stuck more around to the music stuff rather than the street, nigga, you be making way more music in this music. You be making a lot more money in this music shit, legal, of course, rather than... How he was doing it in the streets. Like they don't get. And especially when they go to jail. And shit. The fact that even when some of them. When they come out of jail. They still want to go back on that jail time. I'm like y'all niggas is stupid. Celebrate wins at sentences. Bro fresh out the bin. Get a champagne shower. We're not on the block no more. We're in mansions. Tell them bro lay off the gang thing. Now it's mad. I grew where the pagans live. It's a love-hate relationship. I was gone, went away for a bit. And now I'm back like, wait a minute, wait a minute. I'm back. UK rap ain't dead. I mean, some guys are, but I don't relate. Like, nation come out, chum, pay the idiot. I'm just to go on stage. Please don't panic, we need another one, DJ Khaled It's it, under the focus, he will manage If I was them, I would feel embarrassed What they do in London, I do in Paris When they had a Eurus, I had a Yaris I'm a savage, I've got no manners I quickly overlap all of these rappers But shout out the UK talent I'm the reason the UK valid Flying in girls from the USA Cause I already fucked with this UK valid Hey man, all I can say is Welcome back Central C, it's been a minute Since you even dropped Cause I, even though this is my first time Putting him on my channel Trust me, I know the, I'm, li, Boy, I know about his music I listen to some of his music And not to say he not be fire He be fire, he be rapping his ass off But hey man And apparently they saying about how he dissed Digger D I'm pretty sure that's who he was Cause I see a lot of rap, a lot of I see on a lot of reactors like thumbnails or titles and such. They saying how he dissing Digga D. I could be wrong, but hey, either way, look. If you made it to the end of this reaction, comment down below. UK rap ain't dead, and that makes me know you made it to the end. But it's been your boy Homo Ziggy signing out. Stay positive. Keep the vibes up. I'm out.